Today we have a problem 2 to the power of 100 minus 2 to the power of 99. And we need to solve this equation. To start with, we cannot just simply do 2 to the power of 100 manually, because this will be a really really big number. Even 2 to the power of 10 is already 1024. So imagine if we had 2 to the power of 100. So we cannot solve it like that. We'll start with rewriting this 2 to the power of 100 in another form. We'll write 2 to the power of 99 plus 1. And we also have minus 2 to the power of 99. Of course, logically, we cannot just simply do 2 to the power of 99 minus 2 to the power of 99 because we need to do the exponents first, according to the PEMDAS. So what we do instead? Let's write this 2 to the power of 99 plus 1 as multiplication. And we can do it using some exponent rules to write it like this multiplication between 2 to the power of 99 and 2 to the power of 1. So now we get this equation. And now, if you are a little bit experienced in math, you can see that we have 2 to the power of 99 here and here. So we can put it in front of the brackets, we have 2 to the power of 99, and in brackets we are left with 2 to the power of 1, let's write it as 2, because 2 to the power of 1 is just 2, and everything to the power of 1 is just the same number. And here we are left with minus 1. Not with 2 to the power of 99, because it's already here, before the brackets. So we get 2 minus 1 in the brackets, and we need to do the parentheses first in math. So here we get 1, and we get 1 times 2 to the power of 99, so in the end we get 2 to the power of 99. And you know, we'll leave it just like that, because we'll not multiply 2 99 times. And if you want to test your knowledge with exponents, watch this video next. Subscribe.